Uh, um, actually, uh, ironically, got Twitter like last week. So uh, that's how I heard about it. Um, it's tough for Coach Strong to personally tell us uh, throughout this whole process because there's a lot of guys who weren't in town. Uh, so he couldn't really call a meeting. Um, and it's understandable uh, the way we found out. But uh, yeah, I, I found out on social media, and um, I don't think he's contacted many players personally. What are the What are the emotions? Are you, are you mad? Are you? There's a lot of emotions you can have in a situation like this. Um, Coach Strong has given us a great four years, given a great opportunity to a lot of people, uh, myself included. I'm sure there's been you know 150 to 200 scholarship guys come through since he's been here, and I think he's had a, a profound effect on a lot of people's lives and uh, all for the better. So. Um, you can't be mad at a, at a guy who's given you such a great opportunity and who's, uh, who's done so well and put so much work in for you. Since you have Twitter now, you've probably seen some of your teammates in the tweet. How do, how do you as a leader kind of, or the leaders of this team, kind of get everybody together and, and move on? At this point, we have to really uh, emphasize um, sticking together uh, and, and moving forward. It, it's a player's program, so how the players respond and react is, is uh, how well we're going to do next year. Um, so I think as a leader, uh, you know, I'm, you know, myself and uh, a lot of other guys like Dominic Brown and um, other older guys like that are going to have to really, uh, really try to try to bring the team together. What kind of guy would you like to see be your next head coach? Um, I don't know. I, I trust in Tom Durst that he's going to do a great job in his coaching search. Um, just somebody who's fiery, who will continue to build on what we've built on these last four years. Do you make an effort to kind of keep your teammates here? I mean, yeah. Because sometimes guys transfer in these kind of situations. That's one thing that people people talk about when uh, somebody leaves, and you, you see that a lot. But um, we're going to try to keep everybody here. Uh, we're really going, like I said, really going to try to emphasize on or emphasize uh, keeping everybody together, uh, moving forward, and just getting better throughout this whole process.